All right, welcome back to Touchdown Friday. We move now to the 1AA East bracket. Tarboro and Edenton, they both needed wins tonight to set up that battle of the unbeatens next week in the Eastern Finals. Tarboro, our season long number one team in our Touchdown Friday top nine tonight, the top seed Vikings. They played host to four seed North Rowan, and the Vikings would roll again tonight. They love playoff football in Tarboro, don't they? Tarboro quickly jumps out to the lead. Kamani McDaniels hands it off to Cameron Powell for the score. Tack on the two, and Tarboro's up eight zip. Vikings in control. Tobias Joyner gets the handoff, and he pushes through to the end zone. And then check this out. The Vikings are going to fake the kick. Najee Farmer connects with Cameron Powell on the two-point conversion. Everyone gets on the act tonight. Kyrie Sims drops back to pass, but Farmer is there to snag the INT, and it's all Tarboro. The Vikings win 49 0. The final, Kelsey O'Donnell has more from Tarboro. Brian, what a game here tonight as the first seed at Tarboro Vikings hosted in the number four seed at East Rowan Cavaliers. And Tarboro certainly proving why they are the number one seed here in the 1AA East Division. The Cavaliers traveled just shy of three hours tonight for their matchup, but it did not prove to be enough to stop the guys in yellow. Tarboro scored early and they scored often. The guys were all over the field, both offensively and defensively. And here tonight in round three of the playoffs, this powerhouse team still managed to shut out a very good East Rowan with a final score of 49 to zero. The coaches in the team are excited. Their hard work is paying off. Um, all the credit goes to my assistant coaches and, and my players. Obviously, you know, uh, we put together some pretty good game plans and the kids believe in what we do. They study film like nobody else and they execute really well in practice. It's a focus group. Man, we've been working hard since day one and we just one one goal is just to win a state championship. And we're ready for next week. We're eating, so we're ready for the challenge. I feel great. I mean this is you know this is where we wanted to be at this point in time when we started the season off. You know, we got unfinished business and you know we're not satisfied but it feels really good right now. That will do it here in Tarboro. The Vikings move on to the next round of the playoffs. For Nine Your Side Sports, I'm Kelsey O'Donnell. Bailey, back to you.